Still compiling the numbers, but the Nevada Department of Wildlife says this has been one of the worst years on record for poaching. As News 4's Victoria Campbell reports, people who hunt illegally are risking huge fines and even time behind bars for their crimes. It's, it's been the worst year in uh, memory. After 30 years as a game warden for the Nevada Department of Wildlife, Dave Petula says antelope, elk, deer, mountain lions, all that share the northern Nevada wilderness with us, have been found killed by poachers in the past year. And in most cases, these animals were just shot and left. Uh, they didn't utilize any meat. They just shot the animals and left them there. With the growth of human development into the animal's habitat, we're seeing a lot more activity in shooting and, and people, whether it be thrill kills or whether it be a, a crime of opportunity, shooting these animals and leaving them to rot, which is a real tragedy. Poaching is a catch-all term for any illegal killing of a game animal from a trout to an elk. That could mean killing them in the wrong areas or out of season or at night or without a tag or a hunting license. And it's anybody's guess why it's on the rise here. You know, I think people have a lot of time on their hands, and I don't know whether it's tied to the, uh, the recession or what, but uh, people are out and about, and they see something moving, they shoot it. But seeing something and shooting it can mean big-time fines, thousands of dollars, even years in prison. A case is going to court later this week where two men are charged in connection with the poaching of three deer. One is facing up to four years in prison, and prosecutors say they'll push for as much time as they can get for this ever more common crime. Poaching is a homicide case for animals that happens out in the middle of nowhere. We count on the public's help, we count on sportsmen's help to solve these crimes. Victoria Campbell, News 4. There is a hotline set up to report poaching activity, and there are rewards for providing information about these felony crimes. It is called Operation Game Thief. If you'd like the toll-free number, log on to our website, krnv.com, and just look for a link under As Seen on News 4.